Well, it is a renter's market, meaning in just about every case, if you're about to sign a new lease and your landlord is trying to raise your rent, you can probably negotiate it down. And if not, it may be worth it to look for a new place. I've just noticed that prices have gone down by at least 20 30% in the past year. Lower rent prices, a welcome surprise for Blaine Thomas, who lives in an apartment in Southwest Austin. At my last place, exactly a year ago, I was paying 1900 for a one bedroom, and now I'm closer in the range of like 12 to 1300 How big of a deal is that for you? Um, an extra $400 a month is a pretty big deal <laughs> in this economy. Right now, we're getting relief, which is great news. Austin realtor Olivia Vale says on average, rents are down about 10% compared to last year, essentially going back to 2021 levels. It's a sight for sore eyes after both rent and home prices skyrocketed in recent years. Experts say a big reason for the drop in prices is all these cranes in the sky. During the pandemic, when we saw tons of people moving here by the tens of thousands, we kind of overcompensated a bit with the new development apartment complexes that were being built. The caveat veil says not all rental prices are dropping in the same way in the same spots. Closer to downtown, for example, rents are staying about the same. So if you're looking for a new place, know this. Older homes and more established neighborhoods, those are more robust and we're, we're seeing, you know, more of a flat level there. But um, definitely, you know, if you're looking further outside of town or some of these big new complexes, we're seeing rent prices decrease this year. On the other hand, if you like the apartment you have, but your landlord is trying to raise your rent, Vale says push back. I think that almost unequivocally across the board, no one should be raising their rents this year. That's a sign to get in touch with the realtor, have them run rental comps on what rental places have closed in your neighborhood in the last six months or so. And then armed with that information, you can go to your landlord and say, look, you don't have justifiable basis to raise my rent. Blaine Thomas did just that. They were trying to raise it, um, but negotiated it down to, I negotiated it down to what I was seeing in the market. Um, even at the same complex I was at, the same unit, same square footage was going for almost $400, $500 less. And experts say you might want to lock in those lower prices now if you can, because they may not last. I'm hoping they still low, <laughs> but who knows? And realtors say home prices have actually come down as well, but those drops have not been as dramatic as on the rental side. For 7 On Your Side, I'm John Krinjak, Fox 7 Austin News.